Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This is Gabe with Indigo Software, genuine Microsoft software for less. In today's video, we're gonna be showing you guys how to activate Windows Server 2025 via the command prompt. Before we jump into that video, if you're interested in purchasing Windows Server 2025, remote desktop licenses, Windows 10, Windows 11, or a wide variety of other Microsoft software at a great price, check out Indigo Software, we'll put links down below. So without further ado, let's get started. To see our video on how to actually download and install Windows Server 2025, click the link right here. All right, let's jump into the computer. All right, here I am on my home screen. This is Windows Server 2025, and I actually have yet to activate this operating system. So the first thing we're gonna do is we'll actually just hit the start menu here. We'll type CMD. And then when the command prompt comes up, hit run as administrator. Okay, so this is the actual command here. We will leave this in the description for you guys to directly copy and paste it. Or if you just wanna manually type it, it's DISM slash online slash set edition, and then server standard. You could replace this for data center if you're actually doing the data center version. All right, slash product key. And then there goes our actual product key. And the last thing is accept EULA. All right, now I will be blurring the product key in the video, but I'm gonna go ahead and paste that in here, okay? I'll re-enter the accept EULA, and we'll hit enter. As we can see, the command prompt is telling us that it's starting to update the components and install the product key. And at the bottom, we can see that the operation completed successfully. All right, so we can go ahead and close this down. Let's just check to make sure everything went smoothly. I'll hit command and I to enter the settings. And in system, we actually have this activation section here. And it said something prevented us from communicating with our activation servers. Now, this is not what we were expecting. So let's go ahead and actually troubleshoot this. Okay. And it looks like there was probably just some sort of network issue because now it says we've activated this copy of Windows. And here we can see activation status active. All right, guys, that's going to do it for today's video. If you have any questions about any parts of that process, drop those in the comment section below and we'll get back to you as soon as we can. Again, if you're interested in purchasing Windows Server 2025, remote desktop licenses, Windows 10, Windows 11, Office, or a wide variety of other Microsoft software at a great price, check out Indigo Software. We'll put links down below. So thanks again for watching. We'll see you guys next time.